Correct. We have a champion in the building. What up, Ooh, champ? What's up, big champ? dog? Bro. What's up, Eddie? Yeah. So, so, so yeah. So, what basically took place is, is um, I'm sorry that you guys have to be in the background for this, Buckaroos. <laughs> yeah, you guys came in for the right one. Oh, yeah. it, is. it is. what so, it is. First, I don't talk about the phone shake. I don't. From what my knowledge is, that has nothing to do with nothing. That was just all. No, it trickled from that, for sure. Definitely did not. For sure me. trickled from that. I promise you on everything it I love, it did not. It for sure trickled from that. You're out of your f***ing mind. No, I'm tapped in with that shit. I'm watching that shit. I'm, I'm the, who's tapped in Like, I really watched the, the, the whole podcast. Like, it really happened. So like what that. happened on the phone shit then? I don't know what was said. Don't, don't give a But I know it got messy. Then I'm starting to see people fall off. And... Then that's where we are now. Like, that's all drama, though. That's, that's like drama. that's that's, drama. I, that's what I'm saying. That's what my point was. My point was like the homies probably you know what I mean. They're we know them to be solid, and so when they see shit, they left. They're they're gone, homie. Like so you seen that the solid food left. <laughs> now this food. So, so then that's what gets me people thinking like why are these people leaving? Like these are solid people. They're not just gonna up and leave like that. So. Boom, and I guess, and then boom, now we got a diss. Now we got a diss that we're talking about now. Okay, but the chain of events are very you. peculiar, Thank you. right? Thank you. So look, the solid camarada, the Riverside Factor, Ooh. Big Temps, mm -hmm. leaves Crime Family Entertainment under mysterious circumstances. Out of nowhere. He announces it? He just says, no reason whatsoever. Does he diss leaving? Uh, he speaks on it on American Cholo. Okay. You were beefing oh, oh. with your homie at that time, so you wouldn't know about no, that. No, right? love now. So we'll we'll get to that. So f the next step is, um, old boy comes out saying he has aspirations of being a pastor. After being gone for what? After being on a hiatus. He took and you're a hiatus about, about a month. Going around all kinds of crazy That's stuff. fine. Yeah. That's yeah, not you know there. We're yeah. not gonna delve too deep. No, no, that no, part. no. I'm not saying about so, those stories. So Tams leaves. His right hand man, according to what we see on the internet, boom! Now he wants to become a pastor. He has aspirations. The, the other dude wants to become but a pastor. Then, but, if he loves God, then but that's dope. But then, oh, okay, there's the but. <laughs> one of the most solid individuals known to the Chicano rap game, currently serving life in prison Ooh. on the main line Ooh. in GP, where he is, where I'm not gonna say, amongst other elders and fine gentlemen that have upheld the code and traditions that you and I all live by here till this very day. Buckaroo. Buckaroo, you had to throw the buckaroo. Went, in, went on ahead and released a diss track. And on that diss track cover, it is a rodent, we'll say. Like, what, a rat? That's a very peculiar word, and I like it. <laughs> we'll no. that. It, de so it definitely is. Good. So there's a rodent caught in a trap. And it had a very specific hat on. It wasn't an LA hat. It what wasn't Thresh's was three hat. So it was the IEW so was hat. Crime, whatever. It wasn't an SF hat. Was it cream? It was definitely a hat that represented the label. And the song is called The Truth. Oh. Now is that what it's called? Can we play it? Now go read those subtitles. Uh, uh, for this purpose of copyright infringement. Copyright. Yeah, uh, but, but it is available on the Pimp Rolling TV channel. Shout out to Pimp Rolling. Shout out. Hey. Also, I believe it's available hey. on all platforms. Is yeah. it a banger? You know what? There's I, a lot said in that and, song. And is it facts or you think it's cap? Mm -hmm. Um it's impossible for it to be capped for Ooh. one because I can't allow you to call the homie a liar. No, number call, one. No, I'm just asking about the song. Number one, homie. Yeah. The homie doesn't lie. Ooh. Number two. Yes. He's amongst people that you cannot make accusations like that with without having to answer for said Ooh. accusation. Says it's go. So I believe in my heart yeah. of hearts that Diablo would never do such a heinous act, such as cap. For rap, Ooh, Jack. So there's no, yeah. there's no cap in his rap. That's what you're saying. Facts. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're my you're my dog food. I believe you. Now you're saying, I believe you. Say icon. But you've had issues with the pastor, and I say. Why are you picking with a pastor? <laughs> I would never do such a thing. And if people want to take shots, that's fine. Get drunk. I'm over here chilling, buckaroos. <laughs> but uh, it's a very unique circumstance, and it's shocked, shocked. The world? The Chicano rap world. So far so that even our good white friend, the Grand Wizard, Adam22, is very curious about that. 
He wants him there. He definitely is interested. Oh, you think you you see that coming? I definitely don't. Okay, right. So now, 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 you why why you think that? That'd be crazy. Now, do you think because because uh, Adam for sure is gonna have doors open from? Do you think um, what's his name? <laughs> he text him. Pa- do you think Pastor would want it? FaceTime Adam twenty two. Let's see what the great white hype says. Let's see, homie. Let's see if he picks up. I got hella fans in the chat. That's crazy. I see threats. Threat, threat. Shout out to Diablo. That's Shout all I'm gonna say. He's in the chat. We have they're not actual fans. They're they're talking shit. Like <laughs> they're not actual fans. <laughs> if it isn't the legend, I just want to let you know you are on live on yeah, the do it right, it's not like... Circle Podcast. Well, but do it right. And I apologize if I'm inter interrupting anything important. I'm between interviews. What's going on? Perfect, pal. I have a very unique question for you. We're talking about um, Mr. Criminal and the things that are going on right now on the internet. And we're very curious. Would you have him on your show? I actually asked him uh, yesterday. And what did he say? He seemed open to it. Ooh. Oh, so he's going to take a phone? That's crazy. Uh, we didn't get into the nitty gritty of like scheduling it or anything like that. So what you're saying is, is you're willing to interview we do, we talk about Mr. Criminal right now? Sure, why not? <laughs> I knew I told you. I won. <laughs> I won. I won. <laughs> well, you owe me a <laughs> the, the, not, not to cry on, but if he needs somebody to talk to, I'm here. I'll, I'll give him a fair, honest platform. He's I'm already like... talked to people, and that's why he's in trouble. <laughs> Whoa, what are you... Whoa, hey, Compa Raider, I hear you. <laughs> What's up, <man? laughs> <laughs> you gotta stay bender. Here's your here's your cousin, Adam. <laughs> What's up? All right, Buckaroo. Well, needless to say, we're very happy that people in that type of predicament have you to lean on. Hey man, I'm here for all the Rasa. Ooh, the fuck up, Adam. How does he like the name What's of the food? Sir? Sure. Yeah. You gotta ask him how he's he like. What's going on, Jay? Dog. Come on. He definitely knows your name. That was what you're. See, nah, I'm just playing. These.